And welcome back, everybody. We have a great hour. I'm going to uh, come right out of the gate and ask you uh, and put our testimonial lineup. If you own any of these origami items, please talk to us. We talk about customer picks. Origami kicks butt all the way around. They're so great. Everybody loves it. I think every host here has some origami in their house. Uh, I know most of the vendors do because we use it for storage. Uh, we're going to start you off with uh, one of our favorites here. And uh, I, I actually own one of these products. I have actually have this one in the three tier at my house because at my house, you know, we live near the beach. So there's always sandy feet and stuff like that. So we have this rule, shoes off when you walk in the house. Well, I had a little uh, sort of a cheap wooden one in front of the house that when you put like more than four or five pairs of shoes on it, it took a little lean to the left. And it was just, it was a piece of junk, to be honest with you. This is fantastic. It comes all put together, ready to go. Just pop your shelves in and you will love it. You can put up to 20 pairs of shoes in here. It's four tier. You can use it in an entryway. I have mine as soon as you walk into my house, it's right to the left, like against the window there. And all our running shoes, all our sandals, everything is right there and we love it. If you have a mudroom, uh, if you wanna actually put this in a closet, and by the way, you're not limited to just put shoes on this. If you wanna put whatever kind of collectibles, whatever you want, you can put those on there as well. This is a huge customer pick on hsn.com. And this is the first airing Lou Caputo, come on in. This is the first airing at yes. the new low price, which is $10 cheaper than it normally is. It's $69.95 today, and it's on FlexPay. So I would grab this while you can. This is one of my favorite origamis. because I, I awesome. have two. I have a large yeah. rack in the shed, uh -huh. and I have this that replaced the crappy little like the, 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 the thing that this. was tilting back and forth. The thing forth. that did this, yeah. This is the four tier, which I, yeah. I'm looking at it, and I could probably fit this in even better than the three and move the three into the closet. What a great system. Well, and here's the thing. Since it's origami, yeah. we know that regardless of what other, whatever color you get, they're all going to be powder-coated steel. So, you know, to Guy's point, you can use these outdoors if you want to. Indoors, outdoors, it doesn't matter. Because they're going to be corrosion-resistant, chip-resistant, scratch-resistant. Yes. But the other thing about this is it's fully assembled in the sense that you don't have to use any tools on it. But there's a reason for that, because you, you get some choices with this. Here's, I'm gonna show you how you take this apart or put it together, we'll do it both ways, okay? So I'm gonna take this guy off of here. Now, I want you to notice something. All of these snap into place, and if you look at the side of this, you're gonna notice there are multiple rungs going down here. Right. So you decide where you want the shelves to go based on your needs at that time, okay? They don't have to go in the same place every single time. And they just snap right onto those rungs, up and down and I'll take this last one off. And the whole thing is gonna come flat packed in a box, which is real nice because when you get this or you wanna store it, let's say you're not using it all the time, maybe you're just using it for the winter time when you put your muddy boots and things right. like that. It folds onto about that and then you've got the four shelves, okay? So not a lot of space. When you set it up, now this is the kind of neat thing, I'm gonna show you something fun with this. You set this up, I'm gonna put the bottom shelf on first, and these, again, just clip, they clip onto the rungs. So they just go right into place. It's really interesting, too, because they don't just sit there. They really kind of snap into right. place. So it's nice and secure. Now, let's say that I wanted to put some boots on here, something taller. And with four shelves, that's not going to work, okay? Right, right. I don't have to use all four. I can just put two shelves on, just like this. Snap and now, on. look at all the space I've got in the middle here. So I can put tall, big things. So great. Isn't that neat? Yeah, yeah, and yeah. And then if I want to put the other shelves on, I can slide them right through like this. And this is kind of cool. And I can decide, well, you know what? I need a little more room maybe on the top shelf uh, or the middle two, I should say, right? So I'm going to put this one up a little higher because i got a choice of a couple of rungs here. And that's it. I mean, so real simple. You can use this indoors, outdoors. You can use this for anything you want in your home. And we got a lot of colors today. Yeah, and I want to remind you, too, that you can actually put 15 pounds on the top shelf right. and on the bottom shelf. Yes. And then in the middle shelves, you can put 10 pounds. That's right. And it's fantastic. That's very so good. you're, you're going to love that. Here, here, let's go through the colors. So this is a very soft pink. Yeah, that's the blush. Blush, we're calling it. Uh, so there's 180 left in blush. If you want it, it also comes in that brown color. That's the bronze. We call that bronze. That's bronze. Yes. Next to that, we have the beautiful white. I don't think we have many of the white to go around. There's only 150 left in white. Wow, very popular color. Okay. We've got the, uh, the black over there, a matte right. finish black. Did you see with all the shoes on it? And then what's this one? Well, was this one is actually this? vintage bronze. Ooh, so we have two I different like bronzes. That. We this have one, one that's a get. warmer and yeah. then one that's a little bit darker, and that's what this guy is. You know what I love about these two, Lou, what? is that uh, obviously they breathe. You know, if you're going to be, you're going to be putting shoes or clothes on here. Wire uh, They breathe a little bit. Yeah. But think about, you know, the thing about origami is, is origami is what you make of it. Yeah. All right. So we've got a, a, a bunch of different or, origamis that you can use for a variety of different things. In fact, right. we have our large rack, which you can use for the same thing we're talking to you about now. Totally. But one of the things that I really love about this is that uh, you have that aerated mesh design. Yeah. It allows you to have support, Lou, but at the same time, it, it's not heavy or, or bulky. So if you need to get behind it and move it, you can. You don't have to worry about little people around.
around it. You know, you there are some not. pieces of furniture yeah. that weigh 150 pounds. Yes. And you read about this all the time, Dangerous. about them tipping and falling. Yeah. Yeah. What's nice about this piece of furniture is this weighs 13 pounds. I mean, it doesn't weigh a lot. Oh, it no. doesn't weigh, probably your kid probably weighs more than this. It probably does. Yes. Well, and the nice thing is you were, you were talking about the mesh shelves here. I mean, for a couple reasons. One, airflow. So if you're putting jeans, sneakers, yeah. you know, sweaters, anything bulky stinky on here. Stinky sneakers. Yeah. Stinky, stinky sneakers. Ones, yeah. Or if you're putting your, like, muddy shoes, boots, galoshes, things like that on here, through. they're going to drip yeah. through. And then you can yeah. just hose this down because it's powder-coated steel. Now, look at some of the uses we have in front of us here uh, on the floor because, you know, the first one over here, I'm going to go to this guy that has the, um, the printer on it, the all-in-one, okay? And the reason is you don't just have to use this strictly on the floor. You could put this on a desk and use it as a hutch. Okay? Yeah. So think of that. So if you need that extra space in that. your office That's for perfect. your printer. Yeah, and look at that. Reams of paper, files. I mean, you could put all kinds you of stuff on You know what's nice, that. too, Lou, is it's what? low profile. It doesn't it take is. up. So if you, because especially things like printers, yeah. where I don't need my printer way up high. I like my printer to be kind of off on a yeah. side. Yeah. Where it's unassuming. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, you can keep your paper supplies and stuff like that. And it doesn't take up a ton of room. It does not take uh -huh. up a lot. And especially on a real, you know, a office desk. You've got a lot of real estate on that. That's going to be perfect. Now, this one right here, you could use this in the bathroom, in a baby room to put yeah. all those changing supplies or maybe you want to put these you know with your linens or yeah, laundry you know, room right laundry low. room anything like that and then of course what a lot of folks are going to use it for is your standard right here we're talking about the shoe rack and that's here on the um, the black one right there and you can put a lot of shoes on this guy and the nice thing about this is you can either put it underneath your hanging garments in your closet or, as Guy was talking about earlier, put it by the front door if you want to have people take their shoes off when they come in the house. Look at how here's, nice that here's looks. Here's what I tell people, though. Look at this. Yeah. You're, like, you're instant or you're, Like, if you're sloppy, yep. this is going to help to make you look oh, sloppy. Like that. I mean, come like on. Like that. Less makeover stress. makeover for sloppy people. Less stress because you got less mess. I mean, yes. that's what that's going to come down to. The other thing is, think about this. Everybody's got in their closet that one shelf above your hanging garments, okay? There's yeah. always that one shelf. And that shelf goes from right there above the hanging garments up to the ceiling. Yeah. There's a lot of wasted real estate. Put one of these on on that shelf and now all of a sudden it's like having another four shelves inside your closet. Now I want to show you a little trick though, okay? I'm going to grab one of the units over here. I'm going to stack it on top of this. And a lot of people get these home and when they do they go like, you know what? I don't understand. Mine came with two sets of feet. Okay? Yeah. We got the flat Why feet on the stack? bottom. Yes, yeah. they do. They do stack. You get these pegs. See the pegs right there? Yeah, I got this side. Okay, so the pegs line up just like that. Oh, so okay. you have the option of either, hi, you have the option of either putting the feet on here or putting the pegs on there. But what, watch this. When I put the pegs on this, this thing is rock solid. So Actually, now, we have it up on a table, which side so. is it? Which right. side? Oh, it's by guy's side. Here, watch. Yeah, yeah. Watch. I'm going to just pull this apart so you can see what I'm talking about. See that right there? Instead of the flat feet, let me get out of the way so you can see. There. Yeah. Instead of the flat feet, you've got these little pegs. The top, there's little rubber stoppers in the tops. So you just yeah. pull those out and they stack like this. So now all of a sudden you've got an entirely different option. And remember, you don't have to use all four, all four shelves. You can take any of these shelves out yeah. if you need more space. They're totally adjustable. Totally so as adjustable. I said, that's why when we say, you know, origami is what you make of it. You yes. decide what your need is. And by the way, if you if you need an industrial shelf, if you got more than 10 to 15 pounds to put on a shelf, yep. Lou has the heavy duty we rack, which will hold a thousand pounds. This one holds altogether probably about a hundred pounds. Yeah. That one holds a thousand. So again, a uh, little bit of a different design, a little more industrial, a little bit more heavy duty. But that's, that's the whole idea is that I don't need heavy duty for tissue paper. No. I don't need heavy duty for shoes. No. In fact, I want light duty for shoes because I want to be able to move it if I, like the one I have in front of my door or next yeah. to my door, yep. that is also the corner of a room and it gets filthy. All right, dust, dirt, you sure. know, dust bunnies. I can take the whole rack and I can slide it out. Very easily. Bring my little, I have a little Dyson, little cordless vacuum. I bring that over, suck the little nastiness out of there, and then I can put it right back. So your next question is, uh, well, Guy, Lou, you know, these things are often a pain to put together. That. Yeah, or take not apart. a pain. Yeah, watch Look how easy this is. Watch what I'm gonna do. All I'm gonna do is just open the base like this, and there's no tools required with this. All I'm gonna do is just spread it out, and then you decide how many shelves you wanna put on here. Remember what I showed you in the very, very beginning of this? You don't have to use all four shelves. You don't need any tools. There's really very little skill required, otherwise I couldn't do it. Watch this. There you go, Lou. Look at this. So if I wanted to only use two of the shelves, that's what makes this so versatile. This is fine. You can do this and have all this yeah. room in here for tall things like boots or anything like that. Love it. But then if I say, okay, you know what? I would like to put another shelf on there and I still want to have that room at the bottom because my boots aren't that tall. Look what I can do. Just put this shelf in right here. 
And remember, there's a variety of rungs on the side, so you decide where you want to put it. And that's the versatility that is origami. All right, we're going to go to our phones. Oh, cool. And we're going to go to Virginia, and we're going to say hi to Pat. Pat owns some origami, wants to talk about it. Hi, Pat. Cool. Yeah, good morning. Good morning, my dear. Now, um, our producer told, her, uh, told us that you own some origami. What do you love about it? Oh, I had the portable island. Mm -hmm. I, I guess that's what you call it. Yeah, yeah, yeah the kitchen island. island. Sure. Yeah. And I uh, purchased one with the um, butcher block top. Yeah. That's a pretty generic. Love that one. That's know? my favorite. Yep. Um, on the top shelf, I have... Uh, my coffee pot and my coffee cups. Yeah. Uh, the second shelf, crock pot. <laughs> nice. You know, maybe yeah. dish towels on the bottom, but but they're attractive. Yeah, I, and that's they, the bottom line. Yep. They help you be organized if you want to be an organized person. Sure. But you know, and and I don't want to say they're compact, but as you said earlier, you can put them. In a closet, yeah. uh, put them at the end of a vertical. Sure. You can put them uh, vertical. Well, I yep. think Pat, um, yeah. I recommend these to, to, to everyone. Awesome. I, I to. Awesome. Awesome, Pat. We appreciate that, Pat. Thank you so much. And Pat had one of the island cards. Yep. But the whole the premise of origami is that it it comes almost completely assembled, and most most of them are almost all assembled. Yeah. So you don't have to deal with that. And as Pat said, they're they're compact, yet they really do help to organize you, and they help you they with do. a variety of things. And we'll, we'll I'll say it for a third time. It's what you make of it. So Pat, she got the kitchen island card. She loves it because she's got all her appliances on there. With this, this could be so many different things, as Lewis pointed out. Oh my gosh! Look Office at this. supplies. If yes. you have a if you have a laundry area or even if you just want a little teeny shelf in a bathroom maybe you got a corner and you're like i'd like to put a tissue box on there and some yeah. towels well That's listen it. The, the way tvs are these days there's no reason why if you wanted to use this as a tv card hey. you couldn't do yeah, that if you got a 10 pound you know tv I mean? yes That's oh my god I, i'm telling yeah. you right now I've got, I've got like a 50 inch tv we, at home and it does not weigh we more have than a 15 pounds. we have a 32 inch tv <laughs> yeah that we sell here at HSN, the thin seat, it's 13.8 yeah. pounds. So you could put that on the top shelf. So it's amazing. These are made well. They're going to last oh, you years and years and years. All steel all yeah. the way around. Yeah, 1,500 of these are already gone. Uh, we've got one minute <coughs> left on the clock. Let's do the colors. Hours. Yeah, go ahead, Luke. One more time with the colors. Yeah. Okay, so the one we're looking at right here, this is the blush, okay? Beautiful light pink that you're looking at there. Then on the ground in front of us, that's the standard bronze, okay, the regular bronze. The middle one is the white that you see right there. Then the next one is gonna be the black, and that's a satin finish on the black. And then right here uh, on the top, this is the vintage bronze. So two choices in the bronze. You've got the regular bronze, and you've got the vintage bronze. All right, guys, so those are the colors. We're gonna move yes. on, because as we said, okay. Lou and I have a lot to show you. We've got the uh, the heavy-duty rack, which is a classic that I think everybody here at HSN probably owns. That's coming up in just